At this time, I'd like to invite all of our children to come close to your screens for today's children's message. Today I have with me something very special that I want to share with you. I'm going to have to stand up to show you all of it, but this right here is my puppy blanket. And I had this blanket when I was a child. My mom made it for me when I was in her belly. And she made it for me because she loved me and she knew that I would need something to give me comfort at times. And I used this puppy blanket a lot. You can see that it's worn, that it has been loved very well. I would hold it up to my face. When I would go to bed at night, I would sleep with my puppy blanket. When I would go to a sleepover, I'd sleep with my puppy blanket. I'd bring it with me. When I'd go to camp, puppy blanket came with me. When I went to college, puppy blanket came with me. And this puppy blanket reminded me of home. It reminded me of the embrace of my parents, the love that they had for me. And whenever I missed them, or whenever I was sad or lonely and I needed to be comforted, I could hold my puppy blanket and it would make me feel all better. In today's Bible lesson, we hear from Jesus. And Jesus reminds us of something that is very important. He told his disciples that whenever he was no longer physically with them, that he was going to leave something. That there would be something that would come that would help them to always feel comforted and to always feel the love of Jesus. And that thing that he was talking about, it was called the Holy Spirit. Jesus was going to not be with them in person, but Jesus was going to be with them through the Holy Spirit. So when we are feeling sad, when we need to pray, when we need guidance, we can look to the Holy Spirit, that feeling deep inside and that connection that we get, we can connect to the Spirit to guide us, to make us feel better, and to comfort us. And I'm sure a lot of you have things that bring you comfort. Maybe it's a stuffed animal. Maybe it's a blanket. Maybe it's a hug from a family member. But we also have a comforter that comes in the ways of God and that comes through Jesus and that comes by way of the Holy Spirit. And even though we can't see that spirit, we can absolutely feel it. Please pray with me and we're going to do our echo prayer and I'm going to invite all of our grown-ups to join us too. Dear God, we thank you for Jesus and the ways that he loves us. Help us to remember that your spirit can bring us comfort and can guide us and help us feel more connected to you. Amen.